Developing now plans to make the already congested Tyson's area even more busy. The Fairfax County Board of Supervisors gave final approval for Capital One to redevelop its corporate headquarters. Transportation reporter Brianne Carter live in Tyson's to explain what that will mean for you. Brianne? Allison, take a look here. This is Dolly Madison, the intersection of Scott's Crossing Road. You can see at this time of day, there is a lot of traffic and a lot of congestion. Well, just off this intersection, take a look. That is where the development is all happening. Capital One new headquarters almost complete there. And now with the county giving the green light to this project, there will be more office, retail, and hotel space all packed into this part of Tyson's. Residents we spoke to say that they do see major highlights, including a Wegmans grocery store coming to this. Also, a theater outfitted with an orchestra pit, state-of-the-art lighting, and many facilities that the county will be able to use. Also included in the project, two athletic fields, parks and green space, a game plaza, and parking garages for everyone coming to the area. But does that mean more congestion? Well, folks out here said absolutely. More people coming to that part of Tyson's means more cars out on the road. Some residents though say they think it's worth it. As long as there's a space to put people, I'm happy. I mean, the congestion here is way of life. I mean, if you live here, you can accept the fact <laughs> that it's congested. <laughs> Now, this was the final step in this process, meaning that all of this is now complete and that the construction that is already underway will continue. We expect to start to see most of this opening up within the next couple of years. Reporting live, Brianne Carter, ABC 7 News.